Judge and Jury is the hit blockbuster movie where he finally showed the world what it always suspected. He's not just a scientist bodybuilder philosopher who's the best at everything, Any therapist. but he's also the greatest action star mankind has ever known. We get the deepest and most detailed backstory of his career. All the time I spent in the CIA, this one time I was a Navy SEAL. Before blowing everyone away with his maturity by being with a woman older than all the other women in his movies combined. She's annoying as hell though. You got like five minutes to decide what you want to eat. And choosing between Taco Bell and Pizza Hut isn't some shit you can just rush. While he's dealing with that crisis, she gets herself caught up with these guys. Like to get a pizza that. <laughs> who must not know how she is. <laughs> when he's done eating, you guys are gonna be so fucked. Oh shit, here it comes. And a quick seven minutes later, he shows up and we get the greatest fight scene of his entire career where he shows all the doubters he still got it. Shut up, nobody hurries the great one. You got like five minutes to decide what you want to eat. And who the fuck says BRB? Okay, BRB. Even though the police are in agreement that this was the most badass thing they've ever seen. It's like their souls were just punched, punched, just punched clear on out of them before they were shot in the face. The many, many accusers that came forward from his wild night at Mardi Gras. I recognize those beads. Proved to be his downfall. He then gives Marvel a lesson in how not to be shitty, and we get the most badass post credit scene of a jujitsu master beating the living shit out of two of his severely epileptic students. While it's incredibly offensive, it's also completely fucking awesome. He then does this old trick. Classic. And after breaking out of what's clearly a maximum security federal prison, he gallops majestically into the night like an Australian freshwater crocodile. 